are still working from home, and as we start a new school year, that means many kids will be learning from home as well. So it's just as important to get kids active as it is adults. Um, a lot of adults sit behind desks all day long, and we'll see a steady decrease in health. So what we want to do, we want to, you know, fight that for kids. We want to get up and get moving. YMCA personal trainer Meredith Atterbury says parents and caretakers should schedule in time for activity. Every hour, get up and move, maybe five, ten minutes. Anytime there's a break in that curriculum, get up and move. It doesn't have to be super structured. It can be a jumping jack contest or try and beat your previous score of number of squats or push-ups. It doesn't have to be rocket science, just make it fun. Atterbury says sitting in one place all day can be bad for your health, especially for young children. Because kids want to move. Um, even at school, they have little activity breaks, they have that designated PDE time, they get up and walk to the cafeteria. Well, now when the cafeteria is right behind you because you're working at the kitchen table, that takes out a significant amount of activity. So to encourage a kid to focus for that long, they need that mental break. They need that increase in heart rate, that increase in breathing, and that fresh air is awesome. Atterbury says it's something the entire family can enjoy together. And parents, do it with your kids, you know. You need the mental break just as much as the kids do, so go do something fun together. Those endorphins get going, and it's going to improve the experience for everyone. And if you need a place for your kids to go during the day, the YMCA has you covered. So the kids come to um, one of the YMCA's and we help them with all of their homework and schoolwork. We make sure that they're on their computer when they need to be on their computer. Um, we take lunch breaks when we need to take lunch breaks and we also try and get them physically active throughout the day. We try and practice what we preach for sure. For this week's Workout Wednesday, I'm Carly Lang.